What's going on, Cancer? My name is Vince. This is Seven D Tarot. Cancer, today I'm going to pull your money and career energy, your love energy. I'll see who's coming and going, and if there's any travel on the horizon. Now, if you have a certain amount of money you'd like to manifest, or if you have a specific person in mind, you can go ahead and like this video and subscribe. And if you are interested in scheduling your own personal reading with me, all the info you need is in the description box below. Now, for a totally fresh perspective, you can check out my wife's channel over at Empath Tarot. And stay tuned till the end of your reading where I will pull your affirmation for today and your spirit animal. All right, so let's dive right in. See what we got going on. You were meant to be gifted and rewarded something very big, but right now there's a wobbly energy and it's making you feel undecisive. And how you do anything is how you do everything. So if you're undecisive, the universe can't bring abundance into your life. So for example, like you can't have one foot in abundance, one foot in scarcity. You can't be wobbly and confident. And in order for the universe to gift you this energy, something big financially, it has to, you have to be confident. So source is telling you, radiate the energy, you you want to attract that's it radiate the energy you want to attract and a lot of times we're confused in the third dimension on planet earth because we're so used to doing something and then being rewarded for it but when it comes to manifesting it's the other way around like for example you know wanting something doesn't work like spirit i want to be rich i want to be with my soulmate please help me if that worked everyone would have it right law of attraction law of assumption quantum physics quantum entanglement has proven this method does not work for example if it worked right you would have had it by now so what do you gotta do the exact opposite right now the way the universe actually works is i have a trick you thank the universe in advance right almost like when you ask your buddy for a favor you're like hey can you do me this favor thanks in advance just like that guys it works every single time so right now imagine i wanted to attract uh, a promotion at work so rather than be like oh universe give me that promotion i really need it i'm desperate please help me i love you please it doesn't work right what do you have to do be like universe thank you so much for bringing that promotion to me i am so grateful i'm so grateful that i got that promotion on the following date add the detail I, I can't believe i'm making this much extra money and i can't believe that my boss told it to me in this manner i am so grateful and thankful i've already used up my extra funds and i'm going to pay off my bills and go travel you are the best you never decide point i love you so much universe you always listen to me thank you in advance i love you right when you do this what are you doing you're commanding assuming expecting you're not asking for anything you're letting the universe know this is what i expect here's the shopping list go get it with love now you did it in a fun silly exciting manner right your re 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 frequency was high and you did not beg plead hope wish none of that low frequency stuff right so you basically told the universe what to do without being serious and that serious energy is the reason that things don't happen and this works every time now the trick that i love using is also to like kind of move my body and bounce kind of like bounce and be like universe almost like a tony robbins event right be like universe thank you so much almost like you're praying properly casting a spell properly none of this please stuff none of that it doesn't work guys right but this on the other hand this is how you command the energy that when you start doing this your angels are telling you this is the last piece of your puzzle this is how you change your life and right now your angels are also telling you let go of the how and focus on the why let go of the how and focus on the why how am i going to get that promotion don't worry about that that's up to the universe thank goodness it's too much responsibility for us think of the why why do you want it why not just like i want it because i make extra money great but why do you want extra money you'll be like well really if i get down to it i want extra money because i want to be able to travel and not live in scarcity and just experience stuff i want to go to a restaurant and just order whatever i want and i want to be able to buy what i want in peace and not have to worry about what's in my bank account and not exactly when you focus on the why that feeling that emotion that when you match that to your expectations that emotion has a message in it it has a frequency that message is how you speak to the universe the why why do you want something match that emotion to your expectation deliver that message to the universe now the universe hears you right without that emotion there's nothing the thinking 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 does nothing the feeling 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 that's just when you're dishing out just shopping lists to the universe now speaking of shopping links we got the nine of pentacles you also got the justice cards the source is telling you that right now the more that you invest in yourself the sooner you will get some sort of major financial opportunity and right now source is telling you that abundance flows where appreciation goes this is the cheat code to getting what you're looking for abundance goes where appreciation goes being appreciative grateful and thankful that is the cheat code i'll give you an example right now 
Right now, imagine abundance is whatever you want it to be. You want it to be money, you want it to be your soulmate, you want it to be health. I call that abundance, right? So everything you're looking for. Now treat abundance as a person because abundance is energy. Abundance is not like, it's not like a dollar bill. You know, it's not like a, a avatar. It's actually an opportunity, a synchronicity. Now abundance is a person, for example. How do you treat a person? You have to be enticing. Now abundance is very attracted to someone who's very appreciative. So right now be appreciative. I am I'm so appreciative for the clothes that I have to wear. I'm so appreciative for my job. I'm so appreciative for I have teeth to chew my food. I'm so appreciative that I live in a, in a country that's not war-torn. Man, I'm so appreciative it's raining and sunny and who cares? I am so appreciative. Abundance sees you. Wow, you are hot. Wow, I want to be a part of that. Do you see where I'm going with this? I'm trying to be silly and have fun, but I think you know what I'm saying, right? Like abundance wants to hang out with the person who's appreciative. You want abundance. What do you got to do? Be appreciative, right? It works like a charm. All right, now you got judgment and the four of wands. So right now, expect some sort of inspired action to come in and it's gonna to lead to a major celebration. And right now, your angels are telling you, just focus on being a magnet and attracting wisely. Focus on being a magnet and attracting wisely. You emit, the, you uh, attract what you emit. Very easy, like law of attraction, very simple, guys. So right now, Every single time you feel something, it's like you're writing a shopping list. So right now, if you feel like you are happy, you're sending a shopping list saying, hey, uh, I'd like to order something happy, please. But imagine you feel scared, lonely, sad. You're writing a shopping list saying, bring me more scared, lonely, sad. You don't want that, right? But you know, the law of attraction cannot be bent. You just have to be aware. Uh-oh, I don't have the luxury of thinking this. It's not gonna go well. So right now, Source is telling you to really start tapping into that leap of faith and then you will be rewarded handsomely, right? And your thoughts create and your emotions confirm. And right now, angels are telling you that your reality is a reflection of your dominant vibration. Control your dominant vibration. I cannot express how important this is. Take a look at both of these people. What are they doing? Look at them both. They are controlling their dominant vibration. Why is that important? Because your dominant vibration works every single time. It's like your subconscious, it has power over your conscious mind. So right now I'll give you an example. Imagine you are thinking something, like you wanna start a business. So your mind is like, I think I can do this. But then your dominant vibration is always what you feel, your heart. But your heart's like, I don't think so. We don't have experience, this is not gonna work. Right? So it doesn't matter if you think you can do it. If your heart is saying, no, I can't, the universe thinks, no, you can't. That's just how it works. So you gotta control your dominant vibration. You have to have brain and heart coherence. Your emotions have to match your expectations and using that like energy of why. Why do you wanna do this? That why do you want to do it? That will always make it work. Now right now, I have a trick. It works every single time. If you want the formula to success, it's a two-part series. One plus one equals two. It's alignment first, action second. Alignment first, action second. A lot of times we tend to take action at the worst time. Something happens, you get scared. Oh my goodness, what should I do? Boom, you make a mistake, right? But, in but it's instead if you tell yourself alignment first, something happens, oh, I'm scared, uh-oh. At that point, tell yourself, should I take action? No, why? Because I'm in a low frequency. Okay, what do I do? Get in alignment first. What does that mean? Okay, well, I gotta feel better. So why not eat something healthy? Why not go for a walk? And why not sleep on it? And then tomorrow when I wake up, in peace, I will make the right decision. Bingo. Like how many times did you send a text message and you regretted it? Why? Because you made a fear-based decision. So right now, alignment first, action second is the home run, the grand slam, the cheat code, secret sauce to life. All right, Cancer, I want you to write down the following affirmation in the comment section. Let's get right into your affirmation and clear any sort of energy blocks you may have. Write down the following affirmation. As you write it down as a collective, when everyone writes it, it is very, very powerful. Like it just, it's unbelievable, right? So write down the following affirmation. As you write it down, soak in all the good vibrations, all the good luck and the good fortune that comes with this. Write down love comes to me naturally. This is going to amplify your life. Love comes to me naturally. Write this down in the comment section. Let the universe know you are ready for love. All right, Cancer, now final message from your spirit guides. Wow, look at this. Sweet results await is the message. Be spirit. And right now you can expect something very exciting, very fun, very thrilling, very passionate, very inspired. Something you can most likely monetize as well. Something you would do on a regular day, you know, just for fun. Something that's gonna bring so much uh, uh, awareness, but also so much wealth into your life. Sweet results await quantum entangle with this energy and just have fun with it. Be creative, be imaginative. The person who wins in life who, who uses their imagination, right? That is how you visualize. Be creative with this energy. Something very big is about to happen for you in the short term.
All right, Cancer, hope you enjoyed your reading. Hope there was a message in here for you. If there was, like this video and subscribe. I truly appreciate you. Till next time, follow your passion.